You'll hear the heartbeat another time. I wonder who she'll take after. <laughs> she'll have Trevor's dimpled chin or my pluck. What's the matter? Your blood pressure's elevated. Is it? Oh, well, no wonder. Look at the time. You usually check in on me between six and eight. I wasn't aware you are keeping tabs on my schedule. <laughs> you were late this evening, doctor. Why is that? <laughs> I do have other patients, Janet. One of them is particularly nervous about surgery tomorrow. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to sound critical. Forget it. Now, I did warn you that we had to keep careful watch on your blood pressure. You did, you did. And after all, it can lead to toxemia and affect the baby. It's not that high, is it? Well, it's higher than usual. And seeing as you're already hypoglycemic... Well, now stop trying to scare me. I know. You've been under a lot of stress. Well, I'm fine. Please, let's don't tell Trevor. He's the father of the baby. Well, it's not really that big a deal, is it? I mean, and, and you were the one who said I was thoughtless worrying him when he has a family crisis to deal with. Don't make it worse. I mean, anyway, I, um... Yeah, I already made him mad at me once today. That's probably why my blood pressure is so high. I can feel it climbing. Just thinking about you bothering him. Okay. I won't say anything, I promise. But... You're going to have to follow orders. I will. Otherwise, I'm going to have to prescribe complete bed rest. That means not getting out of the bed for anything, you understand? I will try to be extra good. You promise? Word of honor. Anyway, I don't think you realize what a model patient I have been. At least I've tried to follow all your directions because nothing is more important to me than this precious bundle of joy. Everything I do, everything I've done is for her. Okay, okay, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. He can't hurt you anymore. Well, Dean, open the damn door! Please, it's an emergency concerning his family. What do you think you're doing? I'm calling Trevor. No, you can't call him. Just yes, the yes, I'll hold. I'll you hold can't. while you put me through. You can't call the cops. Adam, there is a dead body here. Now, what do you think you're gonna do? You're gonna throw a handkerchief over it and hope nobody notices? Trevor is Haley's uncle and he's a police officer. Yes, Trevor. Hello, it's Erica. Listen, I'm at Will's apartment. You have to get over here right away. Bodine, open the damn door. I'm coming out there and coming through the window myself. Hang, hang in there, Halo. I'm going to get you out of here, okay? I'm coming. I'm sorry it took me so long to get here, Halo. Who's here? It's me. It's me. It's me. It's Brian. It's Brian. No, 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 no. You can't come no, in. It's, can't okay. Come it's okay. It's okay. Nobody's going to hurt you anymore. What did he do to you, darling? I had to get away. I had to go. I had to get away. Oh, no, no, it's okay. It's all right now. Brian and I are here. It's all right. No, no. You don't know what... You don't know what he did! Don't let her go out there! It's all right! No. Oh. Don't look. For heaven's sake, take look. her in the other room! Yes, come, come on, she's... Go with him, Haley. Go. You don't want to see this.
mighty years, J.C. Penney has brought you some of the lowest prices on things you wanted most. And now, history repeats itself with special 90th anniversary prices on the J.C. Penney bath towel. Town craft shirts, girls' t-shirts, and Alicia pantyhose at a price you haven't seen since the 40s. The J.C. Penney anniversary sale. Prices that make history. Then, and now. Thank goodness for even flow stronger disposable. Brooke. Craig, hi. Hey. Where's Dixie? She went upstairs to check on Adam Jr. Oh. Well, I guess I'll let her know that I'm home. Craig, wait. Do you remember when you once asked me to cover for you and Gloria? Yes, Brooke, I remember that very well. Well, I did that only because you told me and I believed you when you said it was over. It was. It is. And I did it because I thought the silence was best as far as Dixie was concerned. Are you saying that you've changed your mind? I don't know. What does Will have on you and Gloria, huh? Will? Yeah. Is that how he got Gloria to drop the rape charges? I mean, does he know something else about the two of you? Everything will be all right, all right? No, no, no. Don't, don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Somebody wanted him to stay dead for a long time. Pepper. Mm -hmm. There's no way that Haley could have done this. She was locked in the bedroom with the door barricaded. Look, I gotta call this in. Nobody touches anything until forensics get here and the photographers take the pictures. Got it? W will you watch her while I talk to Trevor? Of course. No, 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 don't go. No, no, I'll, I'll be right back. Okay, Erica's right here. She's gonna take care of you. You're okay now, Haley. Really, you're, you're, you're safe. No one's gonna hurt you now. Wait, 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 wait. We, we gotta get Haley out of here before the cops come. She's really out of it, man. He's right, Trevor. Haley's in no condition to be interrogated by the cops. Look, I'm worried about Haley, too. But she was the only one in the joint when he bought it. What, what, what's wrong with you, man? You heard her say she did it. She's obviously been drinking, and who knows what Cortland did to her. Man, it, she doesn't know what she's saying. If, if your cop pals hear that, they're not even going to question anybody else. They're just going to... It's going to be case closed. Ryan, Ryan, get a grip. Nobody is going to railroad my niece. But I'm not going to stack an official investigation. What are you talking about? I'm gonna play this by the book. She didn't do it, Trevor. Look, if you need a suspect, me, all right? I hated Will. I found the body. Ask Adam. He was here. I was here when he walked in the door. Brian, we all hated... We all hated Will. Half the town hates Will. All right. All right, fine. You need evidence, right? I'll give you evidence. Get away from that. No. Brian, no. look! Uh, what look. the hell is wrong look. with you? I told here, you at the time. Here is your evidence, all right? So let Haley go, man. Get her out of here. Spread the news. It's the rhythm of the city. It's the music of the streets. Why did you let him do that? Now that's my fault? I'll take care of this with the department. How? Fingerprints on the murder weapon. Come on, will you just forget about me? Haley's the one we should all be thinking about, all right? Look at her. Trevor, Trevor, please. I mean, we gotta get her out of here. Let me get her out of here before the boys in blue show up or else everything's gonna hit the fan, man. Okay, okay, I hear what you're saying. Amy? Tinkerbell? Look, Brian is going to take you to the hospital, but I need to ask you some questions, huh? Did you and, and Will have a fight? Did he give you those bruises, baby? I need to know what happened. He... He... He hurt me. I'm sorry about that. I'm really sorry. They're, they're torn. They're, 
Did he rape you? I had to get away. I, I had to get away. Come on, you have to do this now. She needs to see a doctor. Okay, Brian, t take her to the hospital. I'll catch up with you later. Go. Thank you. Come on. Come on, honey. Come on. Let me help you, too. Come on. You're going to feel Nicole, so much better when you get out of this place. Trevor, you do need me now. No, no, no. Go, go, go. I'll take care of everything here. Erica, you coming? I'll, I'll follow in my car. You guys telepathic? I was just calling you. One of Cortland's neighbors called. Noticed a lot of activity. Somebody climbing through a window. So what's up? Where is he? Right here. He's dead. Mm. There's been a homicide and you didn't call it in? I told you I was on the phone to you when you came to the door. How long you been here, Trevor? A while. Neil, he's dead. He's gonna be dead for a long time. He's not going anywhere. I was more worried about my niece. She's alive, thank you very much for asking. Did you talk to her? She's in no her? shape. I, I, I had to send her to the hospital. Did I you talk, talk to her? her? No, Did I you find out what went down her. here? She was in no shape to talk to her. I don't believe this. You let a material witness, maybe even a suspect, go without getting any information? From here on, the case will be handled by the book. Oh, you're damn straight it will. Because from here on out, you're off the case. What? You heard me. I hear a vote of no confidence. Your niece was married to Cortland. You hated Cortland's guts. Now, from where I sit, that's a conflict. The chief has your badge. Look, Trevor, Trevor, who, uh, who took Haley to the hospital? Brian Bodine, Adam Chandler, and Erica Kane. What? They were all here when I got here. Erica called me. She, she told me to come over. I thought Haley needed me. So at least three people we know of were walking around here before you showed up. Great. That's just great. Get out of here. We'll talk about this later. Uh, Derek, careful with that murder weapon, huh? Furniture. What? There's at least one set of prints I know of on the murder weapon. Oh, don't tell me. You touched No, no, it. it wasn't me. It was Brian Bodine. He told you that? He grabbed it before I could do anything. Well, what did he do something like that He's for? He's a kid. He doesn't know he shouldn't be touching it. Oh, man. Go on. Get out of here. Be at the hospital if you need me. Trevor. What? I hope she's okay. Thanks. The laptop's still on. Whatever he was working on, my point is in the right direction. Okay, Fry, I'm putting you in charge. What? You got a problem with it? No, sir. No problem at all. Good. Because I expect you to handle it like any other case. That means Dylan and his near and dear get no special treatment. I know you're his friend, but that's the way it is. Fine. But if Tre Trevor's not on the case... I'll get you another partner. Well, it's got to be somebody I trust, Neil. Somebody that I trust as much as Trevor. And who might that be, as if I didn't know? Reinstate Mimi. If you can't swing it, maybe you ought to put somebody else in charge. No, I was going to tell you this anyway. Thanks to your persistent sister, 